Bye bye, illusion. Like we're really leaving, you know? Yeah. This is what I will miss the most. Oh yeah, it's got some nice sweets. <laughs> I'm excited for this new chapter, if that makes sense. And this was my favorite street. I would run on the street all the time. Oh my gosh, this is so sad. afternoon everybody and welcome to my channel if you guys are new here my name is Peyton and this is moving vlog part two so if you guys haven't already seen the first one I encourage you to go check it out because I explain a lot of what's going on because things are complicated due to the pandemic but long story short we have to live at my brother's house for two months so the house that you guys will be seeing for about two or three months is not my new house because the build was delayed because like they can't get like the the materials on time and everything's just like really slowed down which I'm sure you guys understand so I'm starting off today's vlog it is Wednesday if you guys watched the first one I mentioned how we are my sister and I are moving out officially of our house today the house isn't the buyer's house um, until this weekend so we can still like come back here my mom wants us to to like help her like clean now everything but as of today we will be sleeping and pretty much living at my brother's house yeah I'm really excited it is kind of sad but um, it's kind of interesting because the new homeowners actually bought like all of our furniture too so it's not gonna look super empty which I think is good because if it looked super empty I feel like that would make things a little more like real so we're gonna leave here and it's still gonna look pretty much the same obviously like all of our clutter and everything's gonna be gone do you want to come say hi em? my sister I feel like is feeling more sad than I am right mm -hmm. because she I don't know why all my friends live here yeah that's true I feel like I was thinking about it because I've been in college for three years mm -hmm. like I'm so used to not living here and I like super super grew out of this room yeah. But you didn't grow out of your room. My room is really cool. Yeah, her room was really cool. So, that's okay. <laughs> but, yeah, let me show you guys what my room looks like right now. So, basically, all of my clutter... I don't know, like, what that is. Highlighter, perhaps? Do you know what happened? I my highlighter. Oh, wait. <laughs> Emily, I've wondered what that is for years. Really? Every time I like put new sheets on I'm like what is that so yeah all of my little cupboards are cleaned out and trash is away and our bathroom is super empty my sister and I shared this bathroom and I keep telling her to make things really sad that this is the last day ever we'll be sharing a bathroom <laughs> tears mm -hmm. But it's kind of nasty, actually. I don't think I need to show you guys that. And then here's my sister's room. Like, I wish I showed you her room before this moment. Oopsies. Because she is, like, a hoarder. So this is so impressive. Yay! Go, Emily! But, yeah, I think as the week goes along, I will show you guys the rest of the house because there's still quite a bit of stuff. Friday and Saturday is when, like, the moving truck comes and we, like, fully get out of here. So I'll show you guys more of the house then because it's not really that different right now. Yeah. Okay, I thought I would give you a sneak peek. It's like a wreck right now of what everything's looking like. So for example, pretty much everything we're taking is out of the family room. But like obviously like not the blanket and the stuff on the table. But like this is how it's going to look when we leave because we're leaving this stuff here. I don't know if that gives you guys a better idea of what I was saying about how since we're leaving a lot of furniture here, it's not gonna feel super empty and sad when we leave. I keep telling my mom, sorry about my hair. I keep saying to her, I feel like it's gonna hit me in like five months from now that we are moving. Like, I'm just like, it's not processed yet in my brain. So yeah, we just have a bunch of like moving boxes over here and like stuff like that so we are definitely getting there like i said i'll show you guys more once we get the moving trucks here and like we start getting all that stuff out it's just like i have like a feeling like in my like heart that's like a little bit sad but i also think like i was saying earlier like i've been in college for three years i'm so used to like moving from apartments to my house to whatever so this doesn't feel that groundbreaking for me. But like I said, five months from now where I'm like 
hmm, I'm not going to like this home anymore. That'll probably be weird, but I'm super ready to move. I love the new house. Yeah, I'm just like, I'm excited for this new chapter, if that makes sense. And I'm excited for my parents because they've lived in the suburbs for so long and they'll finally be close to like a city where they can like, like my mom can like walk and get like food or breakfast like i feel like that'll be good for her so i will check in with you guys later when something else fun is happening good afternoon guys it is the next day it is currently thursday and we spent our first night at my brother's house last night but my sister and i are back to help clean so i just like vacuumed my whole room and i'm about to dust and then i have to like clean out some of the like drawers in my bathroom yeah i'm just going to put you guys on like a little montage or something um this is what my room looks like they took the mattress out so it's pretty like totally empty that stuff is mine but other than that like we're gonna leave the lamp like leave all this furniture we're gonna leave this so yeah it's starting to feel a little bit more real also i'm in the middle of filming another vlog so you guys will see me wearing this exact outfit in a different vlog just so you guys know but let's get to dusting guys it is friday and we're back at the house i will insert a little clip of my dad and steven <laughs> trying to get the table out of our kitchen because it was a little scary oh yeah it's got some nice weight <laughs> now am i going to be able to make it through or we're going to have to do it from the side oh, sideways okay Uh, the legs. Yep, let's keep coming. Okay. I can't watch. Yeah, I'm scared. But my mom is cleaning out the fridge. Woo! -hoo! And yeah, like, it looks super empty now that that table is gone. Is anything else really different, Mom? I don't think so. I mean, downstairs looks empty, but... So this is totally empty, right? Yes. Yeah, so nothing So else nothing's gonna look yeah, nothing like... Nothing else is leaving. Yeah. So this is finished. And then we used to have like decor right there. This is pretty finished too. My mom said the basement looks empty. So we'll leave like the ping pong table and like the furniture. Oh my gosh, this is so sad. It's like totally empty for them. And the craziest part is this room because this used to be our storage room. So there was so much in it. And now it's completely empty. Here's the workout space. We're leaving this stuff because we don't have anywhere to put it and the buyers want it. So this is upstairs. That's a mattress we're gonna take. This was my brother's room. So after tonight, this will all be gone and the mattress will be gone too. Oh, the closet's so empty. And then this was my parents' room. Looks like they still have some things, but that's because they're still living here um, for the night. Oh my goodness. My sister's room. This literally used to be the most cluttered room ever. Wow, this is kind of sad. And looks like our bathroom's cleaned out. And then my room. This is so crazy. So after tonight, we are moving all this stuff to my brother's house, the house that we're staying in for a few months. And then tomorrow morning, we're doing the finishing touches and like the mattresses and everything like that. And then at one o'clock tomorrow, it is officially not our house anymore and we have to be out. So yeah. <laughs> Well, we have both 
both have black on. Oh. How excited are you to be moving? Not at all. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go see what the boys are doing. So we're back at the lake house, as you can tell. And basically everything that we just packed up, we are unpacking. <laughs> Is this the right angle? Um, usually, yeah, right there. Give them an update on the move. It went well. I broke a mad sweat. You know, used parts of my body I forgot I had. There's Edward. <laughs> Edward is not feeling well. That's why she hasn't been helping with the move. But to be honest, even if she was feeling well, I'm not sure if she would have helped either. <gasps> Good morning. It is moving day and we are officially going to be moving today. Oh my gosh, my hair is literally in shambles. I'm here with Emily, but she's a little sad. She's feeling a little, a little upset. <laughs> so we are actually getting donuts to in my eyes celebrate so yeah we're getting donuts we just ordered a dozen donuts and we're waiting for the guy he's so nice he's making us an extra oreo donut because i wanted it it's like their specialty so yeah and then we're going to stop at dunkin donuts and get coffee because we didn't know if this coffee would be very good so yeah that's the plan my dad and boyfriend already moved like all the mattresses out yeah and then i have to pick them up from the u-haul so it'll just be an eventful morning but i wanted to start off with today's saturday edition of moving all right we're saying goodbye my mom and my sister have been crying i have not cried yet do you want help no. <laughs> steven can i please get a few words well, on what what were your thoughts on this house I loved it. It was cozy. It was fun. <laughs> I don't I don't know what you want me to say. <laughs> this is what it looks like. Steven's covering the address. But we will miss it. And this was my favorite street. I would run on the street all the time. Oh. I have like a feeling in my heart. Of what? Sadness? I'm just like, like wow. Like we're really leaving, you know? Yeah. Dad, what are a few words you would say about this house? Well, it's been 18 outstanding years, <laughs> um, but you know, everything has to come to an end at some point, and you know, we've reached that point for our house. Any words, Mom? Oh, all right, um, thank you, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we're saying goodbye to our beloved backyard. This is what I will miss the most. Look how green it is. Taking it all in, my Fowler gals. <laughs> yeah, Emily says she's gonna miss the trampoline, and I said, when's the last time you've been on it? I'm gonna I miss too. my garden. Yeah, my mom did a really good job on her garden. I think it took me 15 years to do it. I think it did too. Sorry for that terrible noise, I don't know what that is. Are we leaving? Oh, we don't have like a group hug together or something? <laughs> Well, group hug in the kitchen. <laughs> oh, this is cute. Bye bye. Bye bye, Lujan. It's been real. It was wonderful. <laughs> We are officially moved out. We're all cuddling on my bed, and I thought I would end this vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Oh, yeah. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Bye.